Uh, my name is Angeliki, Angela, and I'm from Greece. My name is Gary, and I'm from Accrington. It's about 40 minutes over near Blackburn. Best way. Okay, my name is Osman, I'm from Manchester. My name is Patricia, and I come from Poland. Uh, my name is Andrew Bacanolti, and I live in Bury, just outside Manchester. My name is Joel, I'm from Withenshaw. My name's Neve Hickey and I'm from Presswich in Manchester. Yeah, my name's Chris, I'm from Manchester. Okay, I'm George from Singapore. Uh, it is just a tiny little, little country, south of Malaysia. Mm. Uh, my name is Dwayne, I'm from Thailand, Bangkok, Thailand. <laughs> so my name's Nigel Meadows and I've come from a place called Mosley. Uh, my name is Kate and I'm from Vancouver, Canada. Uh, Hannah, I'm from China. <laughs> Manchester. <laughs> okay, so do you want me to start off with? Uh, I'm trying to think. I don't know. Um, like, bad thing or is that something really strange? I don't know. <laughs> Um, <laughs> um, the strangest thing that's ever happened to me. Uh, oh. um, to be honest, I don't know. Um, I've had a few things and I can't really pinpoint one on the top of my head, sorry. <laughs> um, the strangest thing that's ever happened to me. Strangest thing that ever happened. That's a hard question to be honest. Wow, the strangest thing that has ever happened to me. That's really difficult to know, isn't it? Um Strangest thing that has ever happened to me. Oh, that's a hard question. Um I honestly don't know, I'd have to think about that one. The strangest thing that's ever happened to me. Bloody hell, that's a good question. Hmm, strangest thing that I, hmm. Strangest thing. I don't know, if you've got another question. Cut that one out. Uh, strangest thing that's ever happened to me. <clears throat> I don't know. I don't know. Think about it. I don't know. <laughs> strange, I mean, I have quite a, quite a simple life, quite a normal life. Not many strange things happen to me. Strange. No, no, sorry, I don't I don't have the strangest thing that's ever happened to me. The strangest things that happened to me. Um okay that's an interesting question. Um I don't know, I can't think of any in the moment. I mean what like in what aspect? Like strange experiences or like okay. Uh, unusual, um, maybe a strange dream or a strange uh, encounter. Um. Been asked a video in Manchester. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing. Nothing. No. Mike Rod Stewart. Mike Rod Stewart, another singer. That's about it. Yeah. Okay, maybe is that uh, I forget my luggage on a bus some day, and I was starting, you know, going behind the bus, and just a car just going to, yeah, and uh, but I didn't die, <laughs> so it's okay. But I don't know, it was so weird because I never forget my things, and I was like, I forget my luggage, so it was so strange, but it's okay. I think it's okay. Now, <laughs> but I'm alive, it's okay. I think actually the strangest thing that happened to me was in Wales. I used to work in North Wales and there was one man that I met on the bus and the day after he brought me a um, package, black package, and I found a love letter from him and that seafood. It was um something like it looked like cancer, but I I'm not sure what was that. It was some secret from, from yeah from him. We have a love letter. 
so that was the strangest thing that ever happened to me I think apart from that I don't know I think I could take an hour thinking something through um, what about if I said that I once was in the same dining room as Dustin Hoffman the film actor that was pretty surreal so that was really strange to find myself in his company uh, I got lost like two time or three time over here yes but I, I study everything already to be here but I just still got lost you know it is it, strange for me because I never got lost before <laughs> Strangest thing that's ever happened to me, um, I had a double decker bus stop on my foot when I was 14 years old and didn't break a bone. That's probably the weirdest thing that's happened to me, yeah, yeah, I'd say so. I was very lucky, yeah, yeah. Many years ago, um, I used to wear my hair in braids and somebody wouldn't believe me that it's not a weave so they started pulling on my hair so I thought that was really weird. <laughs> I'm very strange <laughs> but yeah that's the only thing I can think of right now <laughs> so yeah I don't know lots of weird things happen to me like every day like I don't know when I was on holiday and then we got kicked out of our hotel and then we had to sleep in a boat that was pretty pretty strange we were like homeless for a night and that was a bit shit <laughs> anyone else you want me to stop um I suppose it's the realization of my dream. <laughs> if you can call it strange, uh, it has been my uh, boyhood dream to come down to Manchester to visit my my football club, Manchester United, and I made it after 60 over years. <laughs> Strangest thing. I've ridden an ostrich, if that counts. Uh, big birds. They have really hairy armpits. It's not something that really happened to me, but that's the strangest thing I can think of right now. The strangest thing ever about to me was I was on the way home, I was a bit drunk, and my friend left me on a bench to sleep. <laughs> and that was the strangest thing. I don't know. I met, um, should I even say half of this stuff? I met uh, up with a sugar daddy but I didn't actually do anything with him. It was like a coffee date and he was like telling me what he wanted us to do and he wanted me to be his dominatrix and he wanted to be um, what he called like a sissy slave and that was pretty weird. Well, I, um, I got woke up by a couple walking by and they managed to wake me up and I managed to get home but it took quite a long time to get back home because I was so drunk. Jesus Christ, let me think. Strange, something strange. Like maybe a peculiar experience or just random. Oh, yeah, yeah, you can give me all the synonyms, but I still don't know. <laughs> <laughs> the strangest thing that's ever happened to me, probably this. <laughs> probably this. Uh, no, honestly, honestly, I, I really don't know. I really don't know the strangest thing. <laughs> okay, so one of the strangest things that's ever happened to me is um, a week before my father passed away, I had a dream um, where he was saying goodbye and there was a building in this dream which was like a glass building on a beach and I was doing a design course at the time. A few weeks later, I got a book um, through the post and in the book was the uh, exact same image. I can't lie, it wasn't any different. And I, in fact, I actually kept that piece, I, kept, I ripped out the piece, that, it was just exactly the same in the foot. It, you just can't make that one. <laughs> it was crazy. So yeah, that was one of the strangest things that's ever happened to me. Okay. Um, I don't know if it's strange, just like because I'm so stressed about my assignment recently. So I was dreaming the other day that I am a queen in the dream and um, I was put in the, um, I, I was being punished by the king because I failed my assignment. So yeah, that was kind of strange. Yeah. Here you go, you're welcome. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Thank you very much. Okay, thank you. Thank you very much. Is that it? Yeah. Oh. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you very much. <laughs> uh, I wish you all the best in your book and I believe it will be a good trick. <laughs> okay, thank you. Okay, thank yeah. you. Okay, thank you. Okay, thank you very much. No worries.